Today I am going to show how to make thread inside of a pipe. So let's begin. At first select the circle and, and there are, let's check here that our view is unsafe. So select SW isometric. Now select a circle. Click here. Now AutoCAD is asking us for radius of the circle. So take the radius to is too small now make it bigger okay select circle again click in the center point now put the radius 2.1 and for this the thickness will be 0.2 inch our unit system is architectural so the unit is inch now from here it is 2d wireframe we can change it to realistic now click on press pull click now put your cursor here click left button now height put the height 10 inch enter okay now click on draw here you can see that there is helix select helix now select the center point now AutoCAD is asking us for base radius so put the base radius to like the circle of the pipe previous circle the first circle and AutoCAD is asking us for top radius so put the top radius to also now from here select turns put the number of turns 10 now specific helix height so uh, I want to take height in the downward direction so put minus 2 put minus 2 enter now from realistic we will do wireframe Now select circle again, click here, put the radius of circle is 0 0.05 inch, okay. Now we need to rotate this circle, for this select 3D rotate, click here, enter. Now we need to on ortho mode. Now click here and rotate the circle. Okay. 3D. Click here. Enter. Okay. Sometimes it, it makes some problem. Okay, no problem. Let's try several times. Okay. Okay, it's okay now. Now from here, select Swift click on this circle select sweep path so click on this circle enter now ok again select sweep so here it automatically is telling us select object to sweep so this is my object enter now select sweep path this is our path so let's check it's okay. Now we need to uh, subtract the thread, uh, the spring actually, from the pipe. So we will get thread. So select subtract. At first 
select the pipe 3D solid now the spring actually the spring part enter okay no problem again select subtract select the pipe 3D solid enter now select the spring enter yes we can see that the our 3D seed into the pipe rotate this one okay now you can check it carefully a 3D seed inside the pipe so friends if you think this video is useful please subscribe my channel like comment and share my videos and if you have any question regarding this video or any other thing or any suggestion any question you can post that in the comment box thank you